So you run into the problem where your blower won't cut off on you. You go to flip the switch, turn it off, and it won't cut off. I had that problem today. Simple fix. See up in there, you got this wire right here. Sometimes rips off. So I'm literally going to take that off and splice it. You can use that little multi-tie tool that comes with your uh, trimmers. Or you can just uh, get your own T27. See what I'm going to set y'all up at here. connector I'm using that's all I need I could use the same type of connector I'm going with this this is good if you're in the field and you're trying to make a quick repair because uh, just make sure it fits first let me move the camera real quick let's see here let's fit up in there Nope, nope, nope. That's why I do real footage. No big deal that one didn't fit. I keep a lot of these around too. Because I do all my own repairs usually. I took the screw all the way out. Which is hard to unscrew that with the camera on. Now let's see if I can set this up. much room here. Basically you're gonna take this coating, strip a little bit of it away. <laughs> You'll be amazed to know that at some point I did uh cabling. This is what I did all day. Strip cables and stuff for data and uh, uh data and uh geez telephone just when I was 16 and I couldn't get a job with a lawn care company one of their uh, one of the jobs I applied for was the owner of a lawn care company <sighs> sent me to his friend who did cabling alright so that's stripped you see this end you're just going to stick the wire in there like so As you see, and I don't like to do this with um, the wire cutters. I like to get some channel locks, crimp it down to get a good crimp. Make sure it ain't gonna go nowhere. I just crimp all, all over in the middle, really. And that's not that's not coming off. That's the goal, because I've had some where I did half behind jobs, and 
That half iron drive always comes to bite you in the behind. <laughs> so, now, get the screw through there. I know this is self explanatory to a lot of people, but I didn't always know what I know now. Does that make sense? But what I'm trying to do is show people who might not know how to do this. This is when uh, you're doing the process of elimination. And you notice that uh, your blow isn't cutting off. Sometimes trimmers do it too. The trick is doing all this one handed. Right, I'm going to tighten this up and then turn. Alright, see she's in there. Now it's time for a test run. Make sure she's off. Choke, pull. <laughs> Just like that, done deal.